Hi guys, welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. We are at our new location, exploring the camp, and later on we get to uh, save one of our friends, so stay tuned for that. Should be fun. Thanks for watching, guys. Morning, Uncle Arthur. Don't go too close to the water here, Jack. I won't, Uncle Arthur. Good boy. Morning, Arthur. You okay? Yeah. So tell me, was that bad in Valentine? Bad enough to need to move, that's for sure. Oh, hey, Arthur. What you want, Micah? Nothing. I'm just being civil, my brother. Well, hello then. You really are a very charming man, aren't you? <laughs> I've lost my mind, Mr. Morton. Lost it entirely. Nice to see you too, Reverend. I've lost it. I used to be an intellectual. Now I'm just a fool. Well, <laughs> I've always been happy as a fool. <laughs> you all just laugh at me. I know you do. Well... Kinda, because you're kind of a drunk, <laughs> so we do kind of laugh at you. Alright, so we've checked out the camp. We got camp upgrades for everybody. I really can't tell the difference, honestly. <laughs> I think there's... Yeah, I really can't tell the difference. So our next quest is to talk to Dutch, and I think he's back here somewhere. Yeah, he's over here looking at the foggy... Foggy River. You could buy a boat, but I went ahead and did the camp upgrades because it boosts morale. And then we're supposed to find some kind of um, herb for the uh, O'Driscoll boy that we doing, old friend? Uh, uh, it's to funny. help the horses. Us in and up down here. My daddy died in a field in Pennsylvania fighting this lot. I ever tell you that? Many times. I see I'm boring you, Arthur. Worrying me. We lost men back there. We have lofty goals, Arthur. We're trying to reform society to a kinder, truer, better way. Now, of course, there's going to be casualties. We're thieves in a world that don't want us no more. We are dreamers in an ever duller world of facts now i'll give you that but come on we got the day it's nice out old jose says that there's a creek around here i reckon it's full of fish hey Old girl, come on down here. Why don't you show us this crick you've been pissing in? Hey, you don't look too rosy, old friend. I thought this warmer weather would... My days are looking good a long over Dutch. <laughs> Always dream crushing and bubble bursting, you. Come on, Jose. Let's go fishing. All right, gentlemen. Let me show you how it's done. There's fish here. There's a whole lake of them. Because I need to get out for a bit. Me and the old guard. Before any of them back there, oh, there was a us. The curious couple and their unruly son. It feels good here. You did well finding that spot, Arthur. More Charles than me. It's like I can breathe again. Thick and soupy as this air is. Might yeah, it's even kind of do foggy. your whistling pipe some good, Jose. I was once in this country with Bessie. Ah, feels like a lifetime ago. It was a lifetime ago. But hmm, what a life we have lived, how well we have fought, especially both of you. I hope so. But now, when things are desperate, we have to stick with the plan. Make enough money, then find somewhere where nobody will find us. But we don't have to hide. Uh, like where? I got some ideas hatching. But I need you with me, not against me. Both of you. Of course. 
Still, we do need money. So keep a low profile, especially in the local town. After Valentine, I want everyone on best behavior here. No trouble. Yeah, but good luck with that. Turning over the soil and the rocks. See what turns up. That's oh, no weapons. You've got to be discreet. Imagine what a slew of rich, simple tins there must be down here. Oh, this is perfect for you, Hosea. You'll be able to play them like a fiddle. Nothing would give me greater pleasure, but no buts. Not today. We fish You're a train. We You're gonna get run over. Ooh. Oh, there it is. <laughs> like we're gonna get run over by a train. <laughs> Look at these trains. Looks like oh, they're so okay. cool. Uh -oh. cool. Uh oh. Oh boy. Oh, it's hey a now. prison wagon. Hello, gentlemen. Well, look what the cat drug in. I seem to have gotten myself in a spot. Quiet back there. Let's see Who if we can sort this out. Is it Air Strauss? How are you, boys? Fine. This is quite some country you have here. We like it well enough. Is it Jose? Hoagie McIntosh, at your service. Lee Gray. This is my deputy, Archibald McGregor. It's good to meet you. You a Scott? Partly. The best part. <laughs> of course. Now, tell me, sir, what did the silly, fancy fop back there do? Nothing too terrible, I trust. He was accused of running a gold mining investment scam. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm sure he wasn't. He is a magician. I know him. He's a fool. But he is not a bad fellow. Oh, that's that now, guy. Can we... Can we just... Uh... I wouldn't do that if I were you. I... Shit! I... The Anderson boys! I can't have more scandal! Well, allow us to help, my friend. Arthur! Chase wanted man. Uh, and, and take Archibald with you. Just what I signed up for. Come on, big guy! Perhaps we oh. can discuss the foolish magician. Stay with that train! Don't let them get oh, away! Oh, we're chasing trains, guys. Keep your guns holstered. We need them Anderson oh, boys almost alive. Right oh, man, how am I supposed Come to do on, this? Hurry. Oh boy. Come on. I'm going, name, I'm going, sir? I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Arthur Callahan. Oh, I was going to say, Callahan, good please. thing he just My made that up. I'm going as I'm fast as I can. Well, how am I supposed to do this? Oh! <laughs> that had to hurt. To do what? I'm um, going. I can't run any faster. See the flat carriage? Head for that. Okay. As close as you can. You think you can jump on there? Really? Oh, we start. Because you ride like my grandmother. Oh. Oh no 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 no! You're not chipping me, dude. Well, there you go. Come on, we're getting you. Yeah, what are you doing? What are you doing, dude? I thought there was only three of them. Jump. Hey, did he just call me a bad thing? My fingers are tired. Whew. Oh, break free. Break free. Get the hell away from me. Am I controlling this? Yeah, apparently I am. God, my thumb is hurting. Off you go. Oh. Oh, I cannot believe I didn't jump. <laughs> Oh man, 
that stuck. I didn't jump far enough. Oh man. Can't believe that happened. <laughs> Alright, here we go again. Hopefully we won't fall off the train this time. Again with the insults. Alright. You're mine this time. Dirt bag. Rude. Okay, don't fall off the train. Come on. Oh, nice dodge there. Okay. Oh, now no, no. All right. Go, go, go. There's As he one. sits there on his horse. got a knife. Nice little pig hanging there. That's lovely. Ooh. Don't kill him. He's got a knife. <laughs> I could. Yeah, thanks for your help. Take some stuff here. Yeah, we're just peachy. Bring him out here. Ooh, I got beat up. At least you got the door for me. Who did he think was in there? Well, thank you. There you go. Yeah, you did so much. All right, let's take him in. Him in. What about the other? Oh, we'll round them up. Aye, aye, Captain. <laughs> Little does he know. I'm guessing he don't like them. Well, look at this cute little town. Oh, 
Of course. <laughs> the booming town. Sometimes. <laughs> Obviously. Well, sure. Wouldn't want you to hurt yourself. Well, really? Give me a minute. Goodness. You're a patient little booger, aren't you? He lands hard. <laughs> That's funny. Nice mustache. That's Talani. Sometime soon, excuse me, gentlemen. Oh, <laughs> better be ugly rooms. Is it true you were seen talking to that wretched Penelope Breakweight? I can't thank you enough. We're sure. Around. Looks like a scam. I'm renting a caravan on the edge of the town behind the church. It's horrible. Looks like a squirrel docked him. The whole town landed on his face. <laughs> That's going to do it for this episode, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it, and I hope to see you in the next adventure. Bye-bye. I'd love to meet one. It's just talk.